Twerk. I know, I know what you're thinking, man. Oh, why this nigga talking about me? Look, check it out, bro. Real rap. I seen your tweet. You saying this is not a cry for help. You know, you you want to talk one on one with a vet on preparation. You really want to get it together. I just gotta say, man. I got nothing but respect for that tweet right there, B. Like, real rap. I'm glad that you are taking this battle rap career serious now. But you got to understand, bro, you're not in the playground battling. You're getting big time money. You had a lot of battles that you should not have lost. You feel what I'm saying? You really should, like, on the on some G shit, you should be the face by now if you had won a lot of the battles that you didn't win because you wasn't prepared. So for you to put that tweet on Twitter... With all them followers you got, you don't care if niggas try to clown you for it or nothing. Like, I got nothing but respect for you. Because that's, that, that's not easy to do right there. You could have very easily hit niggas behind the scenes and tried to and tried to make it done. But you made it public like, yo, this is what it is. I don't prepare. I need help with preparation. That lets me know you not making a mockery of battle rap no more. You not just here trying to get a quick check. And I got nothing but respect for that. You know what I'm saying? Like, real rap. I don't have to make this blog. I'm doing it because, like, that's some real shit right there, B. And I wish other niggas looked at it from how you're looking at it now. Like, there's no point. Like, why sit here and jeopardize thousands of dollars? If you're going to lose battles, your price is going to go down. Your stock is going to go down. Less niggas is going to call you. You got bars. Never said you ain't got bars. You got performance. You got a nigga. You just different, period. Like, fuck all the bullshit. Like, you you nice. Never said you was trash. You nice. I always said you choke. Because you did. Period. And then we started going back and forth. Because I always kept saying it. Because you kept doing it. But now that I see this. Yeah, son. Now, this is what a winner looks like to me. This is what a, 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 I can see you. Like, if you get the right vet. If a vet take this serious. This tweet and really sits down with you like, look, da, 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 da. I don't know what they'll tell you, but and you really get it through your head like, yo, you know what I'm saying? And you really start coming with three rounds, just wigging on niggas, wilding, not no stuttering, not no fit. Like, bruh, you going to be the face. You could have already been the face. You see what I'm saying? So I just want to say shout out to you, man. That's some real ass shit you just did on Twitter, man. I'm watching. That's some real ass shit you just did. And you know this is me here. We do not like each other. But I, I got to respect that tweet right there, man. All you vets, y'all niggas hit up twerk, man. This nigga's ready to take battle rap to the next level, B. He's dead ass serious. No, the, the niggas don't just tweet that. This ain't April Fool. I don't think he drunk tweeting this. I think he dead ass serious. You know what I'm saying? So we going to get battle rap to grow. The niggas reach out to this nigga. Somebody help this nigga. Air from the fuck up. Shout out to you, twerk, man. I don't got nothing bad to say about you, man, because I respect that tweet. Shout out to you. One.